every now and then I think of you and where you might be now. My memories are just a version of the truth. I know you lived in that northern breeze. When I grow up, I want to be. Here's the story of Compostela. In 2012, I went to Spain. I walked along the edge of the sea, following the magical glow of the supermoon. Some things are worth waiting for. I wanna be. When I returned home, I was so inspired by the city of Barcelona, the sounds of the guitars echoing around the churches, the white stone cities, and the azalea trees. An album of songs was already stirring. I began to write. Barcelona, show me to lie to me. I've got a good thing going. Now you don't have to worry. Got a good. I wrote every day in the camper trailer beside our house. Away from the world, hidden amongst the trees, I found solace. I made this little trailer into my home. Every day I would go in with warm blankets and cups of tea, ink and paper, writing anything and everything that I could dream. It was your face on the news that I couldn't wait to get the details of whatever you'd say. You crossed the borderline down Mexico way. You were the scene of the crime and running away. My songs came from strange and wonderful places, sometimes from my sleep from people I've never met, of my love and tears, my life. Everything spun on a wheel. For this life I live down in the bungalow. You were the king of my heart now, everybody knows. When this fury was finally over, I collected my songs in a basket, spending the fall, the winter, the spring and summer months recording this music whenever I could. I believe that everyone is on their own journey and leaving footprints as they pass by. But I like to think of the pilgrims walking along the El Camino of Spain, kicking up the dust as they go, watching as it floats up into the sky to form a star field, the Milky Way. So I called my album Compostela for the field of stars from which we came.